is that the universe is in us. Hey guys, Deal Games here. We are back in the Deals Gap server. Today we're going to be working on a bit of a new base that I've been designing in creative mode. And I'm going to go ahead and switch over to the sandstone test map, which we haven't seen in a while. And then I'll show you what I was thinking. So we have this thing, which is sort of a hexagon. Don't mind this, this needs to go. Um, tear this out here. Sorry, sorry. Bad beginning to an episode, I know. Just want to show you um, what this is going to look like. So you can see we have... Uh, seven diagonal blocks, then eight straight blocks, seven diagonal, and then we have this little dividing room which comes off of here, and we have lots of room to do stuff in here, so we can put separate rooms in there, and then storage off of the straight parts. I don't know exactly how it's going to go, but I think this is probably a fairly good size for what I want to do. It doesn't have to be huge. We could make it a little bigger. Um, let me go ahead and test a bit of a larger design and just see how it works. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, let's see how that looks. So that looks fairly good as well, that's another design that we could use. 8 diagonal, 10 straight, and it looks like the diagonal is near the same length as the straight. Anyway, let's go ahead and head over to the location where I want to have this. Alright, so I have some materials with me. We're going to get more, obviously. I'm thinking that it's going to be made out of sandstone. The reason it wasn't made out of sandstone in the sandstone test map is because it would have looked horrible. Just put against the background of all the other sandstone. Oh, random eggs. Have these back. Alright, so pearl into the ocean over here. Well, more like a golf. If you're anything in the background, it's just my friend playing Halo. Halo Quattro. Alright, and somebody also somebody has a house right there, so I'm thinking it'll be more towards this corner. Alright, and I'm going to throw my pearls over there. I think the best place to get sand is going to be that hill just because I can level it so easily. Oh, what the heck? Oh, here's a place where I was already doing some quarrying. Okay. I'll just show you this area. Hopefully this should be a good spot right off of here. Just going straight forward. I think it should be a nice spot. And it's also going to be raised off the water. It's not actually going to be in the water. Um, now let's go ahead and quarry some more sand. We may also need some more dark wood. Though I believe I have more back at the house. Alright, so let's go ahead and start leveling some hills here, darn it. Night. It's not good to have night in the desert. All the mobs spawn and it, it just sucks. So we're just going to be doing some leveling of this hill. Luckily we have a super shovel and a super pick. Which will destroy both sand and sandstone with the greatest of ease. Okay. I believe, yeah, that's a one click to mine sand. It's pretty crazy. This isn't even efficiency 5. Though it wouldn't make a difference because it's just a one tick mine. Okay, so we got to make quite a bit of sandstone. And I'm thinking I'd like to go ahead and get some more slime balls and make a sand generator. The problem is that I don't have uh, enough slime balls. It, well, like I just said. I'm, oh, God, that was, that was a poorly formed sentence. Anyway, um, I can't find a swamp. So people were telling me, oh, slime spawn in swamps now. Yeah, I know that, but I can't find any swamps, so can't really do anything with that. I don't think we've even seen a swamp on the Deals Gap uh, map 2, which kind of sucks. Alright, now we're getting to some of this cobble. That's good. Alright, just turning off my heater there. Anyway, we're going to continue mining this out. Hopefully we'll hit some sandstone. He's probably an east coaster, so... 
All right, or a uh, west coaster rather, because it's 11:02 a.m. here, which I do not consider morning. Midday. Okay. Um, getting to the point where we're hitting some sandstone. Oh, get out of here! Hit cactus. Come on, hit cactus. Okay, don't hit cactus. Really good deal. I'm building a new one now. Oh, lag. Why am I getting lag? Oh, backup is going. Okay. That poor person over there is going to see this leveled mountain. Hope they don't get mad. I don't know who it is. Okay. Just keep digging, just keep digging. Alright. Hang on, guys, I'm going to pause real quick. Okay, um... Alright, let's see. We've got quite a bit of sand now, though. I'd still like to have some more. Right, there's a stack of sandstone. Sandstone... Uh, there we go. Okay. So let's collect what we've got here. Try to take out some more of this sand on the top, and then we can really start quarrying for the sandstone itself. Let's take on the hundred map that I told you about this morning. Oh, yeah, I know what he's talking about. Um, he, what he wants to do is make a map where there would be different challenges, uh, different ch challenging builds, rather, that people would have to complete, and then they would be judged on the quality of the build. And I thought it was a pretty neat idea. That would be hard to set up, because if, like, you would have to get judges off of Planet Minecraft, because if I use subscribers, I feel like it wouldn't be impartial. I feel like you guys might choose me over other people, even if their builds were better. But, um, I'd have to get, you'd have to find impartial judges and all that kind of stuff, so it would be fairly hard to set up. Though I would like to do that at some point with him. Is this, no, this doesn't destroy stone as easily. Okay. Now we're really getting some quarrying going. This will be the best way to get it. Is it a one-click destruction? Yes, it is. Or maybe it isn't. Maybe it's uh, two ticks. Okay. Oh, what the heck? I don't want the sand to collapse on me. That's what I didn't want. Bad sand. Okay, so let's see. Um, we can go ahead and t start taking out more sand, I guess. My shovel isn't going anywhere anytime soon, neither is uh, Vulcan's pickaxe. Alright, sand, fairly tedious to quarry. Um, sandstone would not be, but it's hard because it's under the sand. It's sort of unfortunate. I could start going around and using torches to break the sand around here, and that might be a fairly good idea. Let's go under a little ways and see how that works out. Alright, still plenty of room in the inventory. Okay, so what happens if I... Um... What would be the easiest way to do this? That's not very efficient. There's only a piece of sand above there. <laughs> it's very wasteful. Um... Probably better off doing it like down there somewhere, but I don't want to screw up the landscape. Pick up all the sand we've gotten. My sand. Mine. More over here. More spider. Launch. Go away, spider. Launch. I said launch. You didn't launch, so you're dead. And I'm hoping you guys will enjoy this episode. If a part gets too boring, I will go into speed build mode. And put some music to it. But so far, I think my commentary has been fairly good. 
Okay, I gather up all this. Maybe we, now we'll go ahead and get started. Convert more of the sand into sandstone. Do we have another eight stacks of sand? We should. Or four stacks, rather. Yes, we do. Okay, so that's quite a bit of sandstone for now. I've got a crafting table and such that we'll need with me. You go away. Oop. Die. Is this knockback too? Oh, no, that's why. I've been thinking this was knockback, but it's not really knocking him back at all. Just have looting on it and sharpness. I actually prefer not having knockback, because then I can get a double hit and just kill them right away. Or I can do an aerial bash like that and take him out. It's Pearl over there. Oh, I'm going to land right by a skeleton. Several skeletons. Oh, God. Yeah, you get cacti. Leather armor skeleton. These two are going at it, so I can take them out. There we go. Okay. So... Like I said, the best place is going to be over here on this gulf. It's raining right there. Alright, zombie, gold helmet. Let's see, am I in the right place? No, I don't, I don't think I am. You went the wrong way. Oh, creeper. Pearl, take me away. Oh, oh god. Okay, here we are. I believe this is the correct spot. Maybe. Um, where am I in relation to other things? Maybe it's over here. It's really... Yeah, it's over here. Okay. I'm just confused, guys. Double hit, double hit. There we go. Probably should have brought a bow with me. That would have been smart. Because I have a good bow now. I'm pretty sure it's a one-hit kill on almost anything. Alright, here we are, I believe. I don't even know where I am, but this looks like a really good spot, actually. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have to level a little bit of this sand around here. Alright, do a little terraforming. Just to make sure the area is good for the house. Okay. Move this back a little. Cacti. I don't have a cacti farm yet. I don't even think I need one that much. Sand... Oh, that's sandstone. Dang it. Where did that happen? Your sand. Okay. There's that, and this will be moved back a little bit, obviously. But for now, let's go ahead and start work on the house. Okay, and first thing we're going to need are our sandstone slabs, which I've gone ahead and taken from our chests back at the house. And I believe the easiest way to do this. Uh, hello, how wide is this? Start right here. And put. There we go. Okay. This is going to be fairly hard to staircase up with. But I think it'll work. I'm going to show you guys what I have planned for the stairs. It's going to be just like that, all the way up. Right, and how am I going to build under it? That's what I'm wondering. I guess I'm going to have to do it like that. It's going to look hideous underneath, so I'm going to have to go back under there somehow and take it out. Oh, crap. Uh, this is, this is going to take a while. Staircasing with slabs is not the easiest thing ever when you're going above water. God. Can't do this. No. You gotta go. You gotta go. And I'm OCD, so I gotta pick up all these blocks. Oh, god dang it. 
Ugh. I hate this game sometimes. Um, I'm wondering if there's a block that I can... No, there's really nothing I can place there. That I could just afford to lose. Let's get it up first and then see where we go from there. Alright. Good progress, good progress. And then we get back. Oh man. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So that right there is four blocks that we've risen. I'd like to go 16 up, if possible. Because I think that would be best. Ugh. Oh, are you kidding me? Oh, man. Alright, well at least the sandstone is going to be easier. Okay. I can do this. Slowly, but I can do this. Alright, this is how I can break it, but I'm going to lose a bunch of them. Let's see. Which one is doubled? That one's doubled up. So that's got to go. Okay, this one's doubled up. This one's doubled up. Oh, God. Ugh, so bad. Okay, I'm going to go down and try to get some of these. Just because my OCD says to. Any more? Any more? No, it does not look like it. Please do not make me start drowning. Okay, I barely made that. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, and, oh god, <laughs> out of blocks again, um, Yeah, I can take that one out from underneath. Ah! Where are the blocks? I can't see them. No! Where'd they go? Why am I doing this over freaking wood? Why? Uh, let's go ahead and see if we can take out the rest. That's gotta go... It's gotta go. Reach, reach. Dang it, I can just barely reach that. I'll get it from the top. Let's count again just to be sure we got 16 so that we're rising up eight blocks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Got one more to do. Which, there's a block that has to be removed there, isn't there? Somewhere. This has got to go. Nope. Nope. Yep. Oh, god dang it. And some of those blocks. Yes. Is that okay? That's all smooth. There we go. I see, I see some blocks down there. I must retrieve them. Must risk life for blocks. <laughs> That's a reference. Anybody who doesn't get that, you gotta you gotta watch Yu-Gi-Oh! Bridge. Okay, there's that. So we've risen eight blocks. Put the sandstone on the edges. Go, go, there we go. 
Uh, I hate how they, some, like, half the time they still break in sets of twos. Like, when you have them placed inside the boundaries of a, of a block. That's all weird, the way they break. They need to fix that. It's really annoying. There are a lot of things they need to fix that I think about it. Tons of things. Okay, so now we've got that. What we're going to start doing is going ahead and going to the inside of the house. So, right here will be our wall. What I need to do is go ahead and grab some sandstone for that. Actually, I have a ton of sandstone. What am I doing? Okay, so we're doing it 10 wide, I believe we said. Alright. So we'll put that there. That's four. Should I use regular? Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and use regular sandstone. Or should I use smooth sandstone? I'm conflicted. Maybe I will use smooth. Ah, oh, come on, I need that back. Gimme, 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 gimme. Go ahead and pearl up there if I can. Actually, that's a horrible idea. Okay, and it's raining on the deals cap server again. Who would have guessed? Okay, there we go. Let's make this into smooth sand smooth sandstone. Okay, here we go. Let's make sure we have the measurements correct. So we're going to go two more out on this side. That's four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. Okay, now we need some sort of cheap building block that I can afford to waste. So I think we should go ahead and go back and grab some dirt, as well as some other supplies. Let's just see how it's looking from the ground so far. I think it should be pretty nice. Oh yeah, definitely. This is going to be a cool house. My friend's giving me a thumbs up. He thinks it's delightful. Alright, um, let's go ahead and start heading this way. I'm pretty sure this is the direction of my house. I'm right near spawn, so it can't be that far off. Go ahead and grab some extra pearls while I'm there as well. Put some of the crap I've gathered up away. Alright, I don't know how I've been getting around without these pearls. There we go. Oh, am I, am I coming towards, uh, yeah, here we are. Okay. I got it right. Let's see if we can chuck the. I uh, actually would it be over here. Chuck that across the gulf. Oh, here we are. Launch this one over the house. Come on, go. You're my only hope. Oh God, dang it! It landed inside the attic. <laughs> Let's drop through. There we go. Alright, so we'll gather up some more supplies, make sure we have taken inventory for everything. Right, and then we should be good to go. I should make some more torches. That's something that I should definitely do. Um, I could put a, some building supplies in my ender chest, in case I need some extra storage. Or I, I could bring some boxes with me. Go ahead and take a few of these guys with me, and then as far as storage in there goes... I don't know what I'm going to put in there. Let me get rid of some of the crap. There's that. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and take one arrow and bring a bow. Got more chicken. Do I have any more cooked chicken left? No, it does not look like I have any more. Dang it. Um, I don't really want to cook any right now, so I'm just going to take an extra stack of cookies. Okay, cobble. Just random cobble. Gunpowder. And let's grab some building dirt. Building, where would build? Probably in the dirt type blocks. Okay, building dirt and let's grab some more dark wood because we're going to need it. There's that. 
All right, we've got some chests with us for extra stuff, and I think we should essentially be good. Um, let's go ahead and take some cobble just to be safe. A couple stacks of that never hurt. And last but not least, a bow. All right, and this is a super bow. It is Infinity One, Flame One, Punch Two, Power Four. And I think the only thing that could possibly be better about that is Power Five, and I'm not even sure 100% that you can get that. So. Who knows? I thought I saw a creeper over here. Oh, I did. Through the trees. Oh, look at him getting owned. Problem is, the rain puts out his fire. Cook chicken, cook. What? Are you invincible? Okay, you just die when you get touched by it. Snap. Can't pick up the chicken. Oh well. Okay, at least we've got. Oh, I forgot the pearls. Okay, I definitely want pearls because they help me escape fights and stuff like that if I don't want to be in one with a skelly. What? I had invincible. Okay, sure. Why not? Just invincible chickens all over the place. Maybe instead of the cookies, I'll bring. Uh, an extra stack of chicken, and I'll cook that while I'm there. Go ahead and throw some coal in my ender chest. Um, put that in there. Take that with me. Actually, I want the bow. Give me the bow. I'm confused about what I want. Okay, uh, now we need... A couple stacks of ender pearls, and we will go ahead and make another ender chest. I must have, yeah, I have a silk touch shovel. I don't know if that can break an ender chest or not, but I bet I have a silk touch pick as well somewhere. Obsidian, please tell me I have some obsidian. Really? None? I guess I must have lost it all in the wither fight, which we did yesterday. Ugh, what am I gonna do? I don't want to go mine obsidian. I have to ditch some of this crap. Can't bring it all with me. I just want to get this done. I don't want to be sitting around here deciding what I should and shouldn't take with me all day. Oh, God. I definitely need this. I want the bow. I don't really need the chicken. I don't need glass right now, either. So I will take the chicken. That will take... Somewhat, okay, good. Good enough. Let's go. Let's get out of here. Let's go actually do some building now. Now that, now that we've had chess time with Reed. Go. Pearl out. Go. Autobots. Pearl out. Die. Die. Wish flame worked in the rain. I guess it sort of makes sense that it doesn't. Then again, a ton of other stuff in this game makes no sense at all, so why does flame have to be put out by rain? We'll never know. It's just like the center of a Tootsie Pop thing. It's one of those things that nobody really cares about, so they will never try to find out. Okay, here we are. Oh, hello. Creeper, you stay away. Okay, he's dead. That's all that really matters. Dead spider. Let's see if I can get a, a hit from way back here. Is that going out of the... Oh, I hit him. Okay. I thought the arrow was going out of the loaded chunk, so it was just disappearing. You need to die. Bye-bye, creeper. Boom. You dead, zombie. You dead, spider. Punch. The glory of a punch bow. Oh, hello. <laughs> hello, Miss Enderman. Alright, here we are. So now we have some boxes with us. So we can go ahead and store some stuff. 
Oh god. Oh, did you see that bow skill? Ooh, they got owned. Let's go ahead and put these boxes down. Store crap in them. Okay, there's that. We need the smooth sandstone, actually. Um, let's see, what do I need? I need arrows. Need the smooth sandstone. Okay, so, we will continue now. There's that, and then what we need is our, our building dirt. Okay. Building dirt, there's that. Oh god, I cleared it. Okay, well here I am at the bottom of the ocean. Yay! Where's my... Where's my majog? There it is. Oh my, now I'm right back where I started. Okay, done with the enderpearls for now. Alright, so... There's one, two, three, four... Five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, I gotta go ten. And ten. This was correct up here. We Yeah, we established that. Okay. All right, now, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, that's it, okay. Then, now we go for another ten, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, nine, ten, and this should line up with that side. I believe it does. Okay, let's hope that's correct. One, two, three, four. Wait, what did I do? Did I make this into an octagon on accident? One, two, three, four, five. Yes, I believe I did. Oh well. I guess that's okay. Four. Yeah, four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Right, so yeah, it is an octagon. Oh well, that doesn't matter too much. That actually just gives us more room. Three. Four. Five. Six. Four, five, six. Seven. Eight. Uh-oh, that's not good. That is not good at all. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. No. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Oh crap, that's not good. Okay, so a lot of this has to be torn down because I made a st mistake so early. Let's see. So this dirt has to be replaced by sandstone. Okay, I can do this. I got this. Mine. 
four. One, two, three, four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. No, eight. There we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ugh, why did I screw up so early? Oh, man. One, let's make sure I got this correct. One, yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. So this all has to go. Oh God, <laughs> almost fell right there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, this all has to go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. There we go. Alright, so, yeah, that's looking pretty good. Let's go ahead and I want to see if I can just retrieve any of the sandstone blocks because those are fairly expensive and I don't want to lose too many of them. Oop, gonna drown, gonna drown. Oh, I have aqua affinity, so it's not going to do that much damage to me. Let me out. There we go. I like aqua affinity. Go ahead and cr oh crap, drowning again. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um, I'm gonna grab some over here, and then that should be good enough. Oh, gonna drown. Eh, might actually drown this time. <laughs> oh god, careful, careful. Uh. Okay. Didn't drown. Came close, though. I want this last block. Okay. Good enough. Okay. And that ring is looking awfully good. Or octagon, rather. I think it looks nice. What I'm going to do is just quickly go into creative mode and get an overhead view of that. Or actually, you know what? I could just pillar up, but I think I'm going to go into game mode. Alright, just so I can... Make sure everything is correct. Yep, that's looking perfect. So, what we're going to do is now we're going to go ahead and build a little bit around the inside. So, the floor is going to be level with this. Um, what I want to do is go ahead and the floor is essentially going to be sets of smaller octagons with dark wood slabs surrounding the sandstone. Let's go ahead and make a crafting bench, or actually I already have one. Screw it. I'm doing that. For now, anyway. Okay, and this will make the build a little less expensive for us. Let's go ahead and go two in the first time. Um... Yeah, there we go. That'll work. Okay, so we're essentially just making smaller octagons on the inside. Two, three. This takes forever because I have to make sure I place it on the underside of the block, or on the lower part of it, rather. Or it will come out looking all funky and at different levels. Funky fresh. Okay, um... 
this ought to look fairly good because the combination of dark wood and sandstone has always been one that's appealing to me. And off camera, I may try to go ahead and get some slime balls and make a sand generator because this is going to be a fairly large undertaking. Alright, um, I'm going to go ahead and complete this first layer of slabs and see how it looks. Two, okay. Boom. All right. There we go. Okay, now. Now we do this. I make one, may make one more ring. Around the middle, but other than that, other other than that, I'd say we're pretty much good. And then we'll start filling in the middle with sandstone slabs. Oh, okay. Give me at least one back. There we go. More slabs. All right. Yeah, I'm liking the way this is turning out. Friends giving me the thumbs up again. Alright, more slabs. This ought to be a pretty nice base when I'm finished with it. It's going to take several episodes, so I'm not sure if we're going to do a speed build for it or what we're going to do. The nice part about this versus the uh, palace that we were working on in the old map is that I really don't have to worry about danger because no mobs are really going to spawn out in the middle of this ocean. <laughs> Okay. Lighting is also something that I'm going to have to be worrying about here. Alright, there's that. Is that complete? Yes, it is. Okay, so we've got that ring. Let's go ahead and go back into creative real quick. And just see what that looks like. I think the corners could stand to be made one thicker. So, oh. Game mode zero. Let's go ahead and do this. Definitely not going to be using creative to build, but going to be using it to get a, a bird's eye view on the project. Okay, that makes it look a little better, having those edges be one thicker on the sides. There we go. Awesome. Come on. Give me that one back. There we go. Okay, so that's looking pretty nice. Um, I'm thinking I may even make it one thicker. Um, I'm not sure. Let's go ahead and just make the slabs, I guess. I believe we can make slabs from these. Hopefully. Yeah. Here we have some slabs. We're going to need all the slabbage we can get our hands on right now. Deal, how come I can't file Zilla to my server? It keeps saying something about. Uh, but I'm y using the one that's. Using the one. I don't know. I'm, I don't know what would be wrong with this file Zilla. I don't even use file Zilla, so. Alright. Um, we're going to go ahead and s fill this in here. And I think we might go into speed build mode here. Alright, um, I just need to change maps out. Okay, I'd say the easiest way to do this is, just, is to just go around like this. Probably, or even work backwards and do it like that. There's a chance that you can fall in. Alright, that's a pretty good way of doing it. Let's fly up one more time after we get a few more rows completed. And we'll see how that contrast looks between the two materials. And I'm thinking we may put this is going to be sort of a courtyard. It's not going to be. Um, it's not. It may not even have a ceiling. It may have like a glass roof or something, sort of greenhousey. But uh, it's 
gonna have some sort of outside air feel to it, so I may put like a garden or something here. And then my room will be off in one of the corners, like I showed you on the sandstone test map. Alright, so let's go into one. There we go. That's that's looking awfully good. I like the way that's turning out. Alright guys, I'm going to go ahead and check how long I've been recording, and I may end the session here. We'll see you in a sec. Okay, so I've got 45 minutes of footage. What I'm going to go ahead and do is just finish up filling this in with the slabs, and then I think we're going to call it a session. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this. I may upload it as another special, simply because I wasn't doing anything too special. And I think it would be fine to upload it as a one-hour segment. Give me that. Alright. There, that's a pretty easy way to build this. Okay. There we go. That's more like it. But I may just upload this as a full 45 minute segment and give you a commercial break. Which I occasionally forget to do. Actually, I, I don't think I've ever put a commercial break in a video. <laughs> I think I've given you, when I, whenever I give you a long video, I always give you a super long video. You don't get any commercial breaks or anything like that, but I'm hoping you guys will be in support of the commercial break idea. Because it's a way where if I upload really long videos, I get a little extra money just for not breaking it up. And sometimes I wish other YouTubers like Nova would do that as well, instead of making us wait. Um, because they have to record other sessions and stuff, it would be nice if we got a big chunk of recording. That would be kind of cool. But I know that that's not going to happen. Boom. Oh. You, you gotta freaking die. There you go. No? Really? Die. No? Bobbing up and down, Skelly. There we go. Or zombie. Whatever you are. Am I out of slabs? Yes. One extra block. Okay, this is regular sandstone. This can be turned into smooth. There we go. I think this is going to be a very nice base. It's big. It's spacious. I can always... I can add more levels if I want to. It can almost be like Zisto's lens where I have multiple levels with um, different boxes coming out of each. And I think that would actually be really cool. Maybe I will do that now that I think of it. Have some kind of water feature that goes through all of them that allows me to go up and get my way to the other levels. Okay, we should be finished with this in just a second. Okay. Hang on, I gotta pause the recording again. Alright, guys. So... Almost finished. We're getting there. We're getting there. Slowly but surely. This is... It doesn't look like too much when you just see the outline, but there is quite a lot of square footage here. Square meterage. We have to quarry some more sand, and I can go ahead and do that off camera, just so I won't bore you. And I believe I should have just enough sandstone to finish this. I won't have enough slabs right now, but I can definitely go craft more. Dang it. Give me that back. Okay, sure, break two. Why not? Oh. Gotta go. Gotta go. Dead. Okay. Tragedy averted. There we go. This can be made into smooth. Okay, and that should be enough slabs to just go ahead and finish out our first level here. In the next episode, we will get working on our side rooms, guest rooms, all that kind of stuff. Storage, farms, everything we need. Floating in the sky. I don't think I've ever made a base like this before. And I like it quite a bit. 
Alright guys, so that was it for this building episode. Hopefully you enjoyed it. See you guys later. Deal Games, signing out.